OK, so in nav we know that if you want to restart a nav instance, we just go to the service layer and we restart the service of that nav instance and then we restart the instance. Now in business until uh, till a few months back, we didn't have any provision to do that and many of us needed that. So now the good news is uh, in the release wave 2 plan 2021, we have got this update and the general availability is November 2021, which means from November 2021, we have this feature available. So now you can restart your business central environment. So to do that, we need to go to admin center. Here you select the instance. Let's say uh, I'm currently into this instance. So I'll click into this. Here you need to go to sessions. Now here you can see I have got a new button called restart environment. And you can see this is the session I have recently logged in. So that's why the login duration is two minutes. Now, if multiple users are logged in, it will show multiple sessions. Now I simply need to select on restart environment to restart this particular instance, this environment. I'll click on restart environment. Let's see. Okay, it is giving me a message. I'll read it for you. Restarting an environment will end all sessions on the environment and interrupt all currency active users. Restarting may take a few minutes. You can follow the status of the restart on the environment details page. Are you sure you want to restart environment? And then the environment or instance name is there. I'll click on yes to proceed. I'll click on refresh to see the latest status. Now you can see the status is preparing. Now my suggestion is uh, you can click on refresh in few seconds just to check whether the status has been updated or not. So once it is an active status, it means now you can log in. Your environment has been restarted. Still in preparing. Let me click on refresh. Okay, now still preparing. Let's wait for a few seconds. Uh, for me, I have observed that it, it doesn't take more than 25 to 30 seconds. Now you can see the status has changed to active. Now I can simply go and I'll be able to log in. So this is simply you can restart an environment, though it's a very small feature, but it was much needed. So thanks a lot to Microsoft for providing this in the update. Yeah, thank you. See you in the next video.